on a night that wasn't always pretty. The Illini found a way to get it done in OT, and at the end of the day, Illinois head coach Brad Underwood says that's all he cares about. Pretty. I mean, look at me. I'm ugly. I mean, I... I don't care if they're pretty or ugly or what what they are. I do, you just want to win. It, it, it doesn't matter how you do it. Up 10 with 3.30 to go. The Illini looked like they'd cruise to the win down the stretch, but a late 11-0 Husker run put them right back in it. If it wasn't for Marcus Domask making the front end of a 1-1 one -one to tie it, Illinois would have lost. You know, you got to withstand one of those runs. Uh, I thought we took a, a really good punch from them. I thought they played extremely well, and, and we didn't shoot the ball very well and, and found a way to win. I think it just goes to show um, the maturity of this team, like I always say, and, um, and how connected we are. Uh, we just stay together through any adversity, whether it's going good or whether it's going bad. You know, when you get in postseason play, it's in the NCAA tournament, it's, it's a lot of times a one or two possession game, and, um, you know, to get where we want to go. These are great learning experiences for us. The win keeps the Illini in the chase for a Big Ten championship, now tied with Wisconsin at 8-3, and three, a game and a half back of Purdue. We're in control of our destiny, uh, and it's like we talk about, it's one game at a time. Uh, we can only control uh, what we can control. Uh, so to go out and win tonight is very big because it's just one step closer to what we're trying to accomplish. What the Illini can accomplish in the next six days before going to Michigan State on Saturday, number one, get some rest. Number two, some much needed practice time to figure out a few of the issues that hurt them tonight. Reporting at State Farm Center for your Illini Nation, Brett Barron's WCIA 3 Sports.